Hi everybody, welcome back to Rust. We're back in uh, the new SIPS Defense Force HQ, which is coming along pretty good, thanks to the efforts of Thrillhouse, Red Wolf, and Wilsonator. Guys, we're back for more. I'm doing a big batch this morning. Look, we're gonna have like 20 videos off the oh, back nice. of this with progress and everything. It's gonna oh, be fantastic. Yeah. All right, so today, guys, the plan today, we have to get some cloth, right? We have to go out and get some cloth so that we can make sleeping bags. Um, and we probably need to get some doors and shit on the place so that we can find our way back and nobody will stolen our stuff, right? Right, that's right. Thrill right, House yeah. will be the first, yeah. And sniper rifles. And sniper rifles too. All right, so. Um, like I was saying, the base is looking good. It's getting there. Um, and it's all thanks to Red Wolf, who sort of started the base. We met up with him randomly. He was naked. We were naked. Now we all have pants, and the rest is history. So we're going to go uh, set out. I guess we want to, like, leave all of our important shit behind, right, if we're going to go out? Or do you want me to just go out, try to find some cloth, and make my way back? Although, it's a tricky one, though, right? Because... Yeah, we need another wooden box, but we need sleeping bags that we can respawn in. But we need cloth to get those sleeping bags, so it's a tricky one, right? How the fuck am I going to find my way back here? There's no breadcrumb trail or anything. We're kind of close to the dome, though, right? That's like a, a uh, big landmark. Right right? We are in the middle of nowhere. We're kind of close to the dome. Like, I'm pretty sure... See, this is why we need the sniper tower, guys. <laughs> So that we can see where we are. I, I can't see anything over this crappy little mountain. I mean, and I'm too lazy to run up it too. Well, maybe I should become I mean, unlazy. Hour, so I know where they were. Okay. We are nowhere near the dome. All right. Well, I mean, that's not such a bad thing, right? Okay, look it. I'm going to head out. Yeah, not too far and see if I can find some cloth. You guys carry on building the base and stuff, and I'll be back in like 10 minutes. And if I'm not back in 10 minutes, just know that I died and that I'm trying to find my way back, okay? Okay. You guys want to do like a yeah. three musketeers, like yeah. handshake thing before I go? Three, two, one. Cheer. That was great, guys. Okay, I'll be back in a minute. Good work. Keep up the good work. Don't let me down. We're the new SIPS Bye. Defense Force. Bye. <laughs> I love the trailing. I love the voice comms in this game. It's so fucking fantastic. It just trails away as you're running away. It's so good. All right. So I'm out here on my own. I mean, we are kind of close to the dome. Sort of. We're like a little bit out here. But I'm going to try to stick as close as I can to the shore. And I'm going to see if I can find some cloth and some hemp. Maybe like a couple of... I didn't bring a pickaxe with me. That was kind of dumb, wasn't it? I mean, I really should have done that, but whatever. Um, I'll remember to take one out next time. Let's see if like, I can loot some people's stuff. Maybe I can bump into like some more stragglers that can join the cause. Man, I feel like we're actually making some real progress here today. And I think it's because I haven't just recorded one episode and logged off and hoped for the best. I mean, I've done like a couple of episodes and at least we can see the base getting built. We can see, like, some progress being made. We can watch a deer unrealistically climb a mountain, then run back down again, and then sort of unrealistically float on top of rocks and stuff. Like, some sort of weird, sinister, satanic clown deer. Which I'm not sure uh, how I feel about that whole situation, but there we go. Anyway, we have a good group of guys. Red Wolf and Thrillhouse and Wilsonator are all very capable guys, you know. They were in the same situation as me, out here, alone, naked. And together, we've accomplished things. We've befriended Red Wolf, who already had a house, and we moved into his house. We don't even know the guy, but we're, um, we're trusting him. And so far, so good. I'm on the hunt for cloth. And when I find some cloth, everybody's going to be so happy because um, we're going to be able to make some beds. And that's going to make life a lot easier for us as well, right? I hope our big house isn't going to be like the target for many raids. But at the same time, our big house, and if we get like a good chance at fortifying it and getting it ready and stuff, the, uh, the big old house 
might stand a chance, right, against raids. Like, if we can get the defense force together, and we can get, like, some good living accommodations for, like, new people that join or whatever, we're going to have to vet everybody properly because there could be traitors amongst our ranks. It does happen in this game. You know, people will befriend you, lull you into a false sense of security, and then before you know it, boom, they kill you in your sleep, and they steal all of your beards which is a big no-no we don't want any of our beards stolen we need those beards and we also need all of our resources and stuff too fuck this fucking rock i should have brought a pickaxe god damn it you know what i'm gonna do while i'm out here too i'm gonna collect some wood and when i'm done collecting some wood i'm gonna hopefully have gotten some okay is this the stuff i'm looking for like how do i actually do this i've seen these things but i can't I, like i can't harvest them is there a way to do it? Like, do I have to use... Wait. Can I just slam this thing against the... Do I have to use, like, the hatchet or something? Like, I literally, I don't know. Maybe I should go back and ask them. That might be a sensible thing to do. Because this is definitely some weed bushes, right? These, like, like, hemp bush things. This is what I'm looking for. All right. Let's try to remember that this stuff is here. I'll head back and I'll ask those guys how I harvest this stuff. Maybe I need like a pair of clippers or something. I have no idea. Maybe we have enough metal to make a little pair of like gardening shears or clippers. That would be useful too. I would like that a lot. But if that's not the case, man, some of these bases are fucking great. Like I really like them. Uh, you know, these ones that are like out in the water and stuff seem really cool too. Um, I was talking to Pyrian earlier. I'm gonna try to get Pyrian to join us as well if he's up for it. He also has like a really big base on another server with um, all of his stream followers and stuff, and it's it really impressive. I mean, it's really something else. Hey, hey, I can hear something. What was that? I don't want any trouble. I see a bald head. Hey, look, just above there. I can see you. Oh shit! He's his... <laughs> look, he's freaking out. He's got pants. <laughs> oh my god! Hey, look, he's running away. He's fucking scared as hell. Wait a second. Is that fucking Thrill House or one of our guys? <laughs> Hi, <laughs> Thrill House. It's you. Oh man, I was trying to scare you, but I didn't realize it was you. Holy shit, that's hilarious. Hey, Thrill House, how do I harvest hemp and stuff? Like, do I need a tool or do I just press E on it or what? Like, I don't know what to do. I think I found some hemp bushes, but no, just press E. So that couldn't have been a, a hemp bush then. I was sure it was. All right. Well, thanks anyway. I'll head back out and see if I can. You want some of my stuff to take back to the house so that I don't lose it? All right. How do I actually do this? Oh, yeah. Just drop it. Let's drop that. Let's drop that. Drop that. Let's drop that. With some leather. With some cloth. Got some high quality metal ore. And I'll hang on to the key. All right. That's all of it. I'll, um, I'll be back. Wish me luck. Good luck to you too, my German friend. All right. <laughs> Throw us. <laughs> Fucking what a prank. Holy shit. Pranking my own friend. He was just up there, hanging out, harvesting stuff, you know, pilfering goods from other bases and stuff. And then he's got fucking Henry down here, doing the old clown, the, the old clown gig. Oh wait, what's this thing? It's just like a mini palm tree? Man, you get 20 per smack on a little palm tree like this? Holy shit, that is fantastic. God, that makes me so happy. Like I said, I'm out here. I might as well get some wood anyway. And, um, but like the big one is getting cloth. I want to be like the toast of the town when I get back and I've got like 20,000 pieces of cloth, hopefully. And then I can make sleeping bags for everybody. Do you know what really grinds my gears though? Like I'm out here, right? There's some sulfur ore on the ground. I'm out here all this time. I'm naked. I'm, you know, doing my thing. Can I ever find cloth? I mean, I find sleeping bags all the goddamn time. Hang on, what's this? Are these just like reeds or something? Press E. Press E my butt. I don't see shit. These are the ones, right? Or are these not? I mean, they do not look like weed plants. It's gotta be said. Maybe they are just like 
reeds, you know, reeds that you find close to a river or creek or whatever. Apparently, I run by these hemp bushes all the time and I never grab them, but I don't know what they actually look like. These are reeds, too. Can't do shit with those. Is it like one of these little things? Is it this? No. What the fuck? Oh shit, I know where I am right now. Hey, remember I was back here like a couple of episodes ago following the dome thinking I think I met Thrill House like around here and now we're just back here now. I heard gunfire too. I guess I should be somewhat weary of the gunfire. Maybe I have to go like more inland to find the cloth that I'm looking for. Like maybe just following the coast isn't enough. I have no idea, but holy shit. I mean, I would love to just find some cloth and make some sleeping bags for me and my friends. Or we can all just share one. Like, that would work too. I mean, we don't really have what we need to keep the place warm or whatever, so maybe body heat would be enough. You know, three or four people, all from different nations, all come together in one sleeping bag to keep each other warm, to have a fun time. You know, it gets really boring out here. You know, we're living off the land. You know, there's no, there's no like, we can't just play Counter-Strike. We don't have a computer or anything. And we don't have the internet or a phone or anything like that. You know, all we have is, hey, look at this. You can just pick up the stump and it's like 50 wood. The fuck? That is crazy. I've never seen that before in all my time playing this game. It's like a journey of discovery out here. I'm finding out new things all the time. Fucking hemp fibers. Found one. That was 20 cloth. Whoa! Whoa! Hey! 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 <laughs> Slow down! Please! No. Alright. We could have had a friend there, but instead we're gonna pick some magical mushrooms. Whoa! Who is that? I have to get close to see who you are. It miss 2684. Miss, I'm just saying, you don't look like much of a miss, but you know, still very attractive anyway. Are you um all alone out here? No? Yeah? No. You're not. Oh. Um, can you give me 10 seconds to run away before you and your friends kill me? Uh, all right, <laughs> I'm going to take that as a yes. Man, I thought Thrill House was chairman. Fucking Miss 2658239er is obviously very German as well. I don't think, um... He or she understood a goddamn word I said. All right, well, anyway, look it. We've had some success out here in the field today. I'm going to head back now because it's getting dark and I'm scared of the dark. Um, but I did find one hemp plant, which is pretty good. Gave me 20 cloth, which is much needed. Might be able to make one sleeping bag out of that if we're lucky. Hello? Who's that? Wilsonator, is that you? Oh, I found somebody else yeah. out there. And uh, they did not want to talk to me and actually came across quite threatening. But the good news is, is I found some cloth. Only 20, though. Is that okay? It's I've dark. I want to come 15. back now. Oof. All right. Great. Okay. <laughs> Follow me. Oh, man. It's nice to have somewhere to come back to. Holy shit. Watch out. <laughs> good, good. Oh, my God. Look at you. Holy shit. You got a guitar and some armor and everything? Wow, we need some lights up in here, guys. Oh my god, this is crazy. Uh, I was somewhat successful, guys. I have um, some cloth. How much do we need for a sleeping bag again? Uh, a lot, I guess. Oh, guys, you know what else I found? Some magical mushrooms. Are you guys up for that? Sure. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. There's nothing else to do around here, right? I mean, we're all having a barbecue inside. Huge no-no. We might as well just sort of ice the cake with some mushrooms, right? 
Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> This is hilarious. Holy shit. Guys, do those sounds outside scare you guys too? Or is it just me? Like, I'm not a pussy or anything, but I'm just saying. It sounds like there's maybe some sinister badgers or something outside in the wilds. And that's why I've come back to the base. I don't want to be out there in the dark with a bunch of badgers. Also, um, there's a house nearby where a naked man with a woman's name ran into. I don't know how that makes you guys feel, but... Uh, he did not want to communicate with me at all. He just sort of said that I have 10 seconds to run away before him and his friends kill me. So that's why I also ran back. Well, I'm just saying we might have and trouble. And that was like really close. Storm, the storm is brewing. Oh, it, you know, shit. It's, it's coming. So like we need to get that sniper oh, rifle online. If it makes you feel any worse, if it makes you feel any worse, uh, I can see the SIPS Defense Force base from here. The one that got oh. gunned down. Really? Where? You have to show me in the yeah. morning. I must yeah. see this. Alright. You yeah, know what I'm going to do? quite close. Which means I'm gonna... we're, we're probably going to get gunned down as well. No, no. Come on. They are, they're on I our side. We just have to convince the five, them. I don't know. I have bought the five well, guns, so maybe... Uh, that might nice. Help. Nice. Hey, uh, does any of you guys want explosives? Mush. There you go. Explosives. How the hell? Mushroom. Here we go. I put this on here because this sit? is the mushroom. Every door behind you. There. Mushroom. Okay, thanks. Where's the explosives? Are you guys sure you want me to have the explosives? I mean, it's not really... I think it's just a blueprint. I think oh. what you do is you... Uh, learn the blueprint and then you can make them. Oh my they, god. They're at your feet. There once was a man who lived in a shack. I don't know why he lived in a shack. His name was Jack. <laughs> <laughs> terrible. Come on. I fucking worked really hard on that. Jesus. What a bunch of fucking Philistines. Are oh, you thrill house? We had a uh, guy Come on. sitting outside the old base. Oh, One yeah. One of the guys who was trying to get in, and he was sitting there playing the guitar as well. Nice. Uh, this is a good... Warfare. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, this is a good thing. I mean, I think that we... Everyone that joins our little uh, fraternity thing here needs to be naked with a guitar and you know what we're gonna go out there and we're gonna bard the shit out of everybody you know we're gonna go up to the dome we're gonna have like 20 guys out there with guitars singing tunes and just driving everyone crazy and that's gonna be our brand of warfare it's gonna be fantastic yeah oh man that sounds, fuck i love uh, this game that sounds good <laughs> yeah well i mean oh yeah we've got the chest set up as well Oh, great. Okay. How do we get... Is it just campfires for lights? Because holy shit, it's really dark in here. I think you can find, like, proper light stuff later on. Um, like oh, okay. And stuff. Alright. Okay. I'll do first watch, okay? You guys get some shut-eye. <laughs> oh my god! I've always wanted to say hey, that to somebody. You see that okay. in the distance over there? What, with the little light? I can see a little There's light a building over there. out on the water. Where? No, there's like a, a little building sticking out onto the water. Oh yeah, that one, yeah. That, yeah, that's the ruins of uh, the SIPS defense force. Fuck, are you serious? We're that close to it? That's crazy. All right. They say it, well, uh, you can hear the ghosts. Yeah, you can hear them all silently ripping their penises off. In, hey, look, there's a plane. Shit, a plane. Look up in the sky. It's a bird. It's a plane. Ready? <laughs> Look up in the sky. It's a bird. It's a plane. Actually, it's just an actual plane. Named David Blaine. I could not think of anything to rhyme uh, with any of that, but anyway. <laughs> this 
is fucking great. Holy shit. All right. It is almost morning. Guys, as soon as the uh, sun rises, I'm going to go out and try to find a bit more cloth so that we can get these sleeping bags online. Do you like that term, online? I think Does we... that work for you guys? It sounds really technical, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. It's fine, though. Yeah. It, we'll have, like, our own code words for things. I mean, online is not a code word. It's got to be said. But at the same time, it sounds really fucking cool. And it sounds like we know what we're doing, even though maybe we don't. Possibly. I think we know what we're doing. Yeah. Don't get me wrong. I haven't got a clue. No. Okay. All right. It's light enough. I'm, I'm going to go out. I'm going to stash my stuff before I go out. I don't want anyone stealing my new guitar. There are uh, keys in the chest uh, by the door. Did Long you say you, you put a key in the chest by the door? It's a uh, front door. You can all, all right. get one. Okay, perfect. I think I've got one already. It's the wrong key. Okay, thanks. So I don't want this one. Should we um, get some more stone and try and reinforce the rest of the walls? Check my uh, yeah. box. I think there might be some stone in there, but there's definitely some wood anyway, if you want to upgrade to wood before stone. Anyway, I'll be back in a minute. Okay. Here we go. Here we go again. I'm going to go check out the ruins of the Sips Defense Force, which is apparently over here. Uh, I'm doing this before I get my sleeping bag. However, having said that, I did actually go by there before, and I didn't get killed. So maybe there's nobody there anymore. I'm not sure. Anyway. We're out here hunting for more... Oh, look at this. Come up trumps already. Already, look at this. Boom! I found one. All right, so burlap shoes. Do I want to waste anything on burlap shoes? No, I don't. I want to make a sleeping bag. 30 cloth and 100 wood. So we have enough for one sleeping bag now. If I can get like a couple of more hemp bushes though, I can make enough sleeping bags for everybody. And I'll be forever known as the, her the sleeping bag hero of our community, which is a title that I would love to have. Wait, is that two bushes side by side? I think it is. It is. Oh my god. Holy shit. I I actually can make two sleeping bags with what's on me right now cuz I'm sure we have some wood. Hang on a second. Let's not stop there. Boom. Oh my lord. There's more over here. Oh, I think I've done it. Okay, so all of that complaining about not being able to find cloth for sleeping bags. Um, before I take it all back turns out that this stuff is actually pretty easy to come by and We now have enough sleeping bags for the whole crew, which is pretty good What we're gonna have to do is set our spawn points Up with the sleeping bags so that if we're out there looking around and doing stuff and we die uh, We can spawn back in our safe base and uh, We'll make a lot of keys for that box outside too we need metal doors and all of that kind of stuff as well. Oh. Careful, there's gunshots. There's somebody behind me too, I think. I think somebody was running behind me. Oh, shit. It's alright, I'm in. I'm safe. Ah! That's fine. <laughs> it's just Wilsonator. Okay, guys, I got like tons of fucking cloth. Tons of it. You want me to make some sleeping bags? Yeah, go ahead. Alright, I'm gonna do it. Oh yeah, I need some wood too. There's gotta be some wood in here somewhere. Is there wood in here? I should just uh, point out that anyone can come in from the roof. Yeah. We have a locked door, but they can just jump in from above. Oh crap, we don't have mm -hmm. any wood. I can't believe it. Okay, let me put all this stuff back in here safe. And I'll go out and get some wood. Guys, I need to go get some wood. Uh, we somehow ran out of wood. I'll be back in a sec. <laughs> Look, Thrillhouse is all over it. He knows. He understands the needs. He understands the need for wood. Um, I, I also... Some, uh, more stone. 
through house, so left the key. In oh my god, the this is so great. Fuck, these guys are so good. They're just beavering away over there. They're just doing it. It's so nice when you meet some people who are just up for having a nice time, working together, making the dream work together with teamwork. There's gunshots ringing out loud out here. Are any of us bothered? Hell no, G.I. Joe. We're not. You know why? Because we got each other. Sharing the laughter and love. Do, 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 do. Sharing the laughter and love. Anyway. Uh, so I think I need 100 wood for each sleeping bag. So I need to get a grand total of 400 wood. In order to make enough sleeping bags for me and all my buds. Um... Oh my god, don't do that. I did that to Thrill House before and I think it scared the shit out of him. <laughs> that was amazing. I'll never forget that moment that I had with Thrill House in Rust. Also Wilsonator who's chasing me and saying Henry. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, we might as well pick up the hemp while we're out here because we kind of need it. You know, just in case some more people start to join us or whatever. Uh, we're going to need some more sleeping bags. To bring them online so that people can uh, join our cause in um, establishing a foothold on this server, doing the things that we need to do, getting the job done together as a group. It's gonna be great. I think we're gonna need some walls and stuff as well. How much wood do I have? Wow, I have more than enough wood. Okay, you know what? I'm not gonna spend one more second out here because every second I spend out here is potentially another second towards me dying. I do not want to die. I've been alive for a good solid like hour and a half now, which is like a brand new record for me in Rust. And I'm not gonna let it all go to hell. Wait a second. Look at this, there's just big ass pieces of stone here that I can pick up. They're worth 50 stone each too, that's crazy. All right, I'll head back and I'm gonna craft sleeping bags for everybody. And I'm going to take my rightful title as sleeping bag hero of the universe. Or at least of our little group here. Perfect. Oh, man, this place is great. Holy shit, it's really coming along. Guys, I got some wood. I'm going to make some sleeping bags. All right. Here we go. Um, so I want this stuff here. I want my guitar. And I'm going to save my, ma my magical mushrooms for a later date, just in case. All right, so sleeping yeah. bags, we want four. Yeah? Uh, I need to eat uh, now. Okay, that's okay, Red Wolf. Um, we'll continue building and fortifying long, uh, this place. Be... How long will you be online? I'm not sure, but okay. keep checking back. We're going to try to get some more people enlisted to help build up the base and stuff. So don't worry about it. Okay, it's good. Love you, Red Wolf. Have a nice day. See you later. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Oh, man. What a guy. Bye. Okay. We have one sleeping bag online. Let's drop it. There you go, Thrill House. A present from me to you, my friend. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. God, you gotta love German people, especially German people who don't talk. Red Wolf is uh, <laughs> Red Wolf is just sleeping in here. He had to go, and he's not gonna have his sleeping bag, sadly. But there you go. And as soon as Wilsonator comes back, we'll give him a sleeping bag too. Oh shit, yeah. Here we go. This is what I'm talking about, right? Just a bunch of dudes sleeping together in here. I'm gonna rename my sleeping bag. I'm gonna call it. Sips is sleeperino <laughs> so that I remember where I can wake up and stuff. Great. And I'm also going to, with the spare wood I have left, make myself a sign to a wooden sign, hopefully. Oh no, maybe I don't have enough stuff left for a wooden sign. Or is it in here? It's in here. Okay. I'm going to make myself a wooden sign so that uh, people know which bed is mine, right? We have to, like, start organizing our chests. Um, okay, and the second sleeping bag is done. So I'll put that into the chest here by Mushroom, and I'll tell Wilsonator about it, too. Fantastic. Man, a small wooden sign makes takes, like, a fucking minute to make. Holy shit. Wilsonator, is that you? 
I hear someone creeping around out there. Oh yeah, it is you, Wait, Wilsonator. I made you a sleeping bag. It's in the chest back here. You want it? Uh, yes, please. It's just in this chest right here. There we go. Nice. Thanks. My sign should be online any minute now. Make yourself a sign too so that you can properly like sign up your bedroom. This is Thrill House's bedroom right here. Looks like a little girl's room. It's got um, fine furnishings and everything you would expect to find like in a girl's room. This one's my bedroom. Looks like a real bachelor's pad, right? With all the modern furnishings and stuff. All the things you'd expect from like a rich, young, good looking, handsome, wealthy man, such as myself. And of course, this is your bedroom, which uh, looks like you're a bit homeless and I don't know like what decor this is meant to be, like dungeon decor or something. Like, yeah, it looks like trash. <laughs> Walks away. I mean, I would have done the same thing, actually. Okay, great. So anyway, that hurts, I'm gonna... man. That really hurts. I didn't mean it. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm really sorry. I was just, just, I was just joshing you. Sorry about that. Okay. So let's have. How do you, um, actually make one of those signs? It's in like the umbrella category. Oh, okay. Yeah. There we go. He's on it. Yeah, I got one. I'm going to make my, you know what? Actually, before I do that, I'm going to trash this. I'm going to paint it all white. Okay. Do you I need want any my... food? No, I don't. No, I'm fine for now. Thanks. I'm perfectly healthy. I hope you can hear me. I don't know if you can hear me. Sips. Here we go. With a little, you know what? I want to have like a big one. Sips. Here we go. With a, an exclamation mark. Why not, right? And then let's have like a little red line underneath here. There. Oh, man. What do you think of that? Holy shit. Man, my bedroom's the best. Holy crap. <laughs> All right. Just you, <laughs> Just you wait. Yeah, right. Okay. We're done for now. Uh, we have had a successful mission in that... We've made sleeping bags. We now have a place to rest our head. We've got a base courtesy of Red Fox. Wilsonator is decorating his trashy dungeon room. Uh, Thrill House is uh, also going to decorate his uh, little girl's room as well. And we should be good. Excellent. Well, I hope you're enjoying this. We did a little bit of a batch so that we can make some progress today. It's looking good. We're getting there. We're going to do a little bit of work offline, I think. Um, sort of get this place reinforced and... Um, hopefully uh into a state where we can't get raided super duper easily and then from that we should be able to go out and do some raids and some excursions and collect materials and hopefully get some cool guns and make a sniper tower and all of that other awesome shit great well as usual thanks very much for watching and i'll see you next time